Alrighty, turn five, December eleventh, forty-one. Let's see what kind of damage I can do to Rob. All right, capture Leoig. Leoig. I don't know. Whatever that base is. All right. Allied sub. Let's get it, boys. Nope. Well, as long as we keep it away from us, that's fine, too. Oh, a big fat tanker. Oh, we missed. Oh, oh this ain't going to be good for him. Don't waste the big guns. You know, we probably, we'll probably hit it. We'll probably fire a ton, bunch of torpedoes, too. Yeah, big guns. Come on, let's the destroyer sink it. With guns, not torpedoes. Come on. There we go. Pound on it with the with the deck guns. There we go. All right, not much ammo wasted. Here we go. Let's, come on, get it. Oh, my twos. There's a damage. Another damage. Three damages. I think that was four. Five. Oh, we're out of ammo. We got five damages on it, though. Come on, someone else coming in, picking up the attack. Nope, I don't think so. All right. Yep, here we go. PT boats. Figured they were they were coming. Why are we attempting to evade combat? Oh, because we're probably this is probably the bombardment one that's low on ammo. Which means they might catch our transports. There we go. There we go. That AVP is gone. Yep, she sunk. All right, let's sink these guys. Don't want them to get too close. Can I get any hits? Nope. Need to do some strafing runs, I guess. Up, oh, attack on the surface for an AGP.
I don't think that'll sink it. Those four inch shells just aren't big enough just aren't big enough. Let's get into the daylight. There we go. Now if we see those PT boats, we should be able to hit them. Bad weather everywhere, huh? Wow. Wow, he's brought everything up here, huh? All right, what what did we find? Uh, fleeing merchies. I'd rather kill warships this early, but I'll kill any ship. Might give my pilots more experience. nothing left of this AKO. Alright, both of those should be sunk. We'll see if we hear anything sink in here. Nope. But four 250 kilogrammers on that Mergy should should kill it. There went something. Really, that's all I'm going to get in the I mean, morning air phase is one strike. Well, I guess two if you count the one up in China. Of course, bad weather, bad weather, bad weather. Surface engagements, or are we going into land combat? We should be moving into Hong Kong this turn. Alright, see what was there. Come on, can I ever take this? I just don't know if I have enough firepower. Got it, alright. They all ran, but the, let's see, we killed a Hudson and 32 squads. All right. And we did not attack a Hong Kong because we had enough force to cross into it without act, without the shock attack. So we expand some bases, going into production. When that's done, we'll pause the video, grab some saves, grab some data, and we'll go over to after action. Hoping we made it into from Mersing West, too. Into Kluang, I think it is now. Oh, 
Alrighty, another decent turn for us. Um, let's go ahead and go over some score. School, we went up 79 points. The Allies went up 28. In the air, we lost three. He lost three. Let's take a look at those. We lost two Nates and a Dina, Dina to Ops. He lost a Hudson to Air to Air and a DC-2 to Ops. So we lost three planes. One pilot dead, the other two fine. All right. If you also looked here, we got a pilot up with three kills now. But we need more. Incoming units really aren't anything to see. Um, we have nothing really coming in anytime soon, so that's just what it is. Production. These numbers are kind. Of, these numbers are kind of shitty, but we're only on day, on what day day five of the war. So, Let's see, we got. 15, 35, 11, 32, 7, 33s, 3 Oscars, 3 Zeros, 3 31s, 2 Kates, 1 of all the rest of the aircraft, and 1 HA-5, but no 34s. Hmm. Okay, well, that, that fa those factories are pretty low at the moment still. Incoming devices. We built nothing, really. Not some, there's, there's some mortars. Some... High heavy machine gun, infantry squad. We 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 produce very little, which is fine. All right, let's go ahead and pull up combat reporter. We'll take a look. We'll go through that. Take a look. All right. At vegan, we had some uh, ASW uh, S thirty six Allied sub popped up. We spotted it. Um, we went to attack it, but didn't get anything. No no real good shots. It came back again, popped up. It did not attack. We attacked it, and we got five hits on it, one of which I believe was a direct hit. So hopefully that guy's going going home. Near Sharong, um, we ran into the that fleeing AKL with a surface task force, and we obliterated it. Near San Fernando, the Filipino PT boats finally showed up. Um, we were, this is our bombardment task force, um, pretty, pretty low on ammo. So they fired a couple shots and then ran away, came back to another one. The same thing kind of, we didn't really, didn't really engage it much. And I believe this guy fired a bunch, but, but didn't hit, didn't hit anything at all. Down near, near at Java, uh, I fit 154 was pretty active. He claimed himself an AVP with two torpedoes. And an AGP, well, I'm not sure if he killed this. It, he surfaced and pounded on it with some shells. Le he then left it, and it, 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 it was burning, so we'll see. Near Oosthaven, um, I-155 spotted a tanker, fired a pair of torpedoes, but missed. We can't be missing these guys. These are the guys we really need to kill. On the ground at Kuantan. We finally captured it after, what, four four days of assaults? We got three to one. We captured it, killed a Hudson on, on, on the runways, and his units ran ran away. But we we got 32 squads destroyed, all from that Indian Brigade, which will drop it down to maybe top of, like, 50 assault, assault value. So it shouldn't be a problem anymore for this regiment to handle that. At Canton, we we bombarded to see what he brought in there. Just a just just a single core. We'll probably attack it this turn to get to kick it out and, and maul it. In the air, we had a bunch um, attack the task force here of two AKLs. Um, I'm almost positive they both sunk. Um, wasted some torpedoes on them. The problem is there's other task force around, but they were covered by weather, so we did not get to attack them. At Sarong, he bombed, got nothing. Hong Kong Fortress, we bombed them. We bombed some Chinese units. He bombed us at Lashia with a, with a bunch of different different uh, units there, but didn't do any real damage. So he bombed with some Blenheims there. Then he hit the, the, the paratroopers here with some Hudsons and some more Blenheims. So. And then he bombed our, our division marching south of by Canton. We need to check and make sure that it made it in, in, into, in, into Hong Kong or else we cannot attack this turn. Signal intelligence, the typical uh, Japanese version is shit. So that's what, that's what, that's all, that's all we get. 
Ops report. Let's see. Just escorted. Yeah. Transferring troops. We're pulling out the paratroopers. We're sending them some more supplies. Two regiments got some upgrades. Two nature still in the pipeline. Let's see, we built a fort, and we well, we built two we built two two forts. We got we killed three ships, and an, a, and an AK arrived in Nagasaki. So let's go ahead and close this. Come back on the map. Hop over into. Burma, nothing going on. I still have troops marching. They're they're still down here, so they have a ways to go. You're talking, you're probably talking a couple weeks before anything starts happening up in uh, up in Burma. Hopefully by then I'll have most of Malaya uh, occupied. Down here we got troops on the move everywhere. Um, our somehow we went all the way to, oh no, yeah we went all the way into Georgetown with these tanks. So I'm not sure what's going on there. But we're going to go ahead and, and attack here. Just, just pre-war uh, units, there's not a whole lot here. I'm, I'm not sure if a tank regiment is enough to take it, but we're going to find out. We have another tank unit coming over here, another one coming down. These guys are all moving. It's going to be slow for a while because until we get on the west coast, there are no real, real roads here. At Mersing and, what is that, Kluang. Our, one of our tank regiments is made, made it down the road into the base. I guess it's a recon regiment, but doesn't matter. It's, it's uh, motorized and it moves and we're, and we're in position. We are blocking the rail. We got a bunch of men following. The first one there is going to be the tank regiment. He'll get there for sure. And then these guys, most of these guys should arrive as well because they're over, they're over half, halfway there to go marching down, down, down that road. So most of these guys should be in Kluang Klu next turn. Um, we will attack and take it and then, and then start building, building that up. Uh, taking this, we'll lock everything to the north pretty much right now. Everything up here is gone. He, he'll probably flee into Temulo. That seems to be the, the spot of choice. Um. I may just let him sit there and rot for a while because I have other plans for my troops other than a, a long siege. Sumatra, nothing going on. Borneo, we move, we're moving some uh, fighters down to Sinkawang. We also move fighters down to Cote de Beru. Um, we're moving stuff out of Miri and, and Brunei. You can see we got a lot of ships on the move, a lot of task forces, some of there's probably about half half of these are full of supplies and troops that are half are, are empty from the first wave heading heading back home. Got some enemy ships here. I think those are uh, just some merchant ships fleeing. And Luzon, we have almost the whole northern half. These guys, these bases have nothing in them, so they will fall. We got troops here at 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 Ling, at, at, at Lingayen. We have a division at uh, Iba. So he needs to decide what he's doing. It looks. I can't tell if those ones are moving. I would love for them not to head head north. I'd love to get down into Clark and then trap these guys and kill them and, and take you know take take Manila. That's by a division or so. Everything we can kill, you know, out we can keep out of Clark, the better off we will be. We have not landed in Mindanao yet. Um, carriers over here. This guy was protected by storms last turn. We're moving deeper in, trying to pick up any, trying to kill any, any anything we can find at this point. We're picking up troops, uh, paratroopers at the different bases to move them back. We dropped off, or are still dropping off. I think, nope, it's all the way off. A base force here at 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 the Tsarong. So we'll start expanding that base. I think airfield first. Um, let's see, he's heading back home for a, re, a resupply, rearm. We got more more ships moving here. So moving in the Marianas. The truck has not really done much yet. Got a bunch of ships coming over from, from the Marshall Islands into truck. Troops coming down from Japan. We got troops headed to Legaspy here. We have a big task force right here heading heading up heading up into into Luzon as well. Protected by this by this cover force. We got a division here heading heading south. 
And we're picking up more troops along the coast here. And that uh, I think we still have another division somewhere here. Uh, I think we had. I thought we had one more division. Did we already pick him up? Maybe, maybe we already already picked him up, and and he's he's heading out. But we had a couple divisions in Japan. We needed to move out. Um, we're starting our we're starting our resource runs. China and Manchuria, I really haven't done a whole lot with. I need to pick up the game there and get get stuff moving. Otherwise, I, I'm just not have not gonna have any chance up in any of these theaters. And that's about it for the turn. A typical, you know, pretty re regular turns here in the early war. Um, pretty much everyone has to go through the same thing. You slog your way through Malaya, Luzon, and so forth, because you have to take them before you can really do anything that that you want to do. You you need you need you need you you need Singapore to go to to really go into Burma. Then you need the oil from uh, Java, Sumatra, Borneo. You need all that oil. You need Luzon. Luzon out of the picture so you, you can get that oil home. So it's just, I mean, it's the same thing every time. It's a matter of what, which one you take first and, and how you do it. To me, Singapore is vastly more important than, than, uh, than a Luzon. Once, if, once Luzon's neutralized and all the aircraft are gone, it's really not that big. You don't really need it for a, for a good, you know, I want it by like, you know, end of 42. But other than that, it doesn't really do much for, for you. There's a little resources and production there. But compared to opening up Burma and and uh, Sumatra and Java, it's not nowhere near as, as important. But that's what's going on in the turn. If you enjoyed watching Unfold with me, please go ahead and click on the like button. If you're following this campaign along but you have not subscribed to me, please go right ahead. I would appreciate that as well. And until the next turn, you guys all have yourself a great day, and I'll see you later.